Michael Jackson The Experience HD on the Vita looks average and in terms of features is kinda average. But even if on paper the game sounds average, Michael Jackson's music along some spot on buttons on the screen make the game an awesome experience. The first time I saw the game I thought that it would be mediocre. But the first time I booted up the game was last night. I wanted to go to sleep and I said ah let's just test it and I ended up playing half an hour and it felt like it was only 10 minutes. I felt good playing the game. Now this doesn't mean that the game is perfect. Sometimes Michael looks like a wet potato. The motion capture is good but the CGI cutscenes before and during the songs aren't. They are ugly. I wish they would have made them better or put the original music video in the background. That would have looked better. Ok now reviewers would have said that the game developers are lazy if they would have put the music video in the background. Then I have another idea. Why not have the option? Have 3D modeled CGI music videos, uh, music video cutscenes like they are now in the game and also have the option to put the original music video in the background instead of the CGI ones. Also another complaint I have is um, why does Michael dance alone? In the CGI cutscenes there are people. In the original videos he is dancing in a group. The 3D presentation is almost accurate to the music videos. Why couldn't they just add more dancers along Michael? Also I wish they would have added the option to play the game with buttons. Physical buttons. Instead you are using only the touchscreen. The controls feel good but it would have been nice to have the option to play the game with physical buttons too. For example in harder difficulties you will notice that in some moments while you touch the screen to hit some notes some of the new notes are being covered by the rest of your hand. This is not a big deal if you are a casual gamer, but if you want perfect scores, this will eventually annoy you. I wish they would have added the option to play with physical buttons too. Also a small detail I really like, it's very nice, is that Michael has unique dance moves depending on the song you play. He has the dance moves that appear in the music video of that song, the dance moves specific to that song. It's a really nice detail. Also in the game there are unlockables, like new gloves for Michael or figurines. Also you can have ad hoc battles with another friend with a Vita. If you have a friend with a Vita. All in all, even if the game seems mediocre, if I describe it to you, Michael's music, along some spot on button controls, turns the game into a great experience. The game succeeds to make you feel good. Even if on paper the game doesn't sound like something. Ok so this was the video. If you liked it please hit the like button and subscribe. If you want to financially support me in my pursuit to review as many video games as possible you can do that on Patreon or on the channel's membership section. You will help me a lot. If you want you can follow me on Twitch, Instagram or Discord. And if you want to see another video of mine, just wait till I stop talking and terribly thumbnails of other videos I've made. Thanks for watching.